Jen Boomerang teacher, Maddie Ziegler. Yeah. Every week, Keenan and Fiction are just amazing, so I think everyone's expectations are high, and they get higher each week. Nice, get him out. Ooh. 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 Hey, and that's sick. In the <laughs> Maddie. This was so fun. Every week, I feel like you guys have either a theme or a cool costume, like you were bees. But this week, it was cool because you it was just strictly hip hop. And like Luther said, I mean, he doesn't really like to use the word, but the only way to describe it is you guys just have swag and you're too hey. yes. so <laughs> you're too cool for school. Yeah. Right yeah. What do you Although think, you should Jason? go to schools. Every contemporary dance that Tate has done so far has been pretty serious, but this week, since it's about sisterhood, it's okay to smile every once in a while. A little sisterhood. Sisterhood, sisters, siblings, rock. I agree 100%. I mean, you guys are always beautiful together, but you really are becoming so much more than just a dancer with exquisite lines. You're becoming just a phenomenal performer, so well Thank done. Thank you. Okay. Maddie, what did you think? Well, first of all, another incredible piece by Travis Wall. <laughs> I love you guys so much, and you are so cute, and your relationship is great as friends. <laughs> and <laughs> I think that you guys dance very mature, especially this week. I thought your fluidity was really, really good, so great work. nice to see a different side of you guys dancing because recently I feel like your dances have been either like intense or very like serious so, yeah, yeah, yeah. so it's cool to bring like a happiness in the beginning of the season there were three ballroom dancers and now Ruby is the last one standing so she needs to really represent you are amazing you're like an adult when you dance because you're just so <laughs> mature and you're clean and like everything Thank about you. you is just phenomenal yep. and I really do agree and I love seeing you have so much fun because you are such a goofy person yeah. so it's cool to see you bring that into this drive yeah. <laughs> yeah. you're not in you like it I I just loved it and I was so excited to see you guys together again because last time you guys did duets I was just amazed and I am so impressed yet again because you are completely opposite dancers and you're out of your comfort zone yet you're looking Phenomenal. Thank so, you. great yeah. job to Mark. Thank Good you. teamwork. Maddie, what did you think? Yeah, you guys did great. And I thought you kept your character throughout the whole dance, which was great. And you didn't look tired. And <laughs> your friendship was just, it was very, very believable. But I'm sure it's very <laughs> true. And I just loved it all. Thank you. Crazy. My goal for this is to get people to see a different side of this rhythm. My stuff is pretty intricate. Ah. Oh, close. Building and layering the rhythms are going to be the most challenging part. Emma will be doing one step and then Gabby will finish it off. So they really have to trust each other's timing in this routine. Do you know the song? Yes, I know. Maddie, what did you think? Such a great routine from Nick. It was so, so good. You are... <laughs> it was so creative how you added extra sounds to the song, We Will Rock You. And... <laughs> 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 yeah, got, it. got it now, got it got now. It? Okay, good. Um, but yes, you were so incredible, and everything about this routine I just loved. And Emma, you were right up there with Gabby. Thank you. This dance explains what this whole season is about, how the All-Star is passing down the torch to the next generation, and how JT is looking up to Robert. The hat symbolizes the essence of the older dancer that this younger dancer idolizes. My hat's all sweaty. I know, I'm sweaty, look. When you hand over the thing that you care about the most, you know that you're putting it in the hands of someone that you care about the most. Passing that on to JT is something that I really want to do. High five. Yeah. High five. I'm proud of you. Great Thank job. you. You're welcome. I, I agree 100%, and this dance was the perfect story for YouTube because I think you look up so much to Robert, and I can just see it. And you guys were like a match made in heaven, so. Yeah.
It was great. Let them wild out and just be Banji for a bit. Give them a little Banji in here. What does that mean? Banji stands for be authentic, never jeopardize your individuality. I, yeah, that's what it means. <laughs> Banji is a certain type of chick. She's strong, she's in control. I think it's perfect for them right now because they're at the point of the competition It's like them against the world. <laughs> Literally 90% of the dance is with the bat. Making sure it's in the right place. They have to make sure they duck on the right time so they don't get hit in the face. They really have to rely on each other. Go rip it. Hey! hey. Ah. <laughs> no more Girl Scout cookies. Out! Boom! Maddie, what do you think? Yeah. Knowing from my experiences, it's very difficult working with props. So well done because you guys did not look stressed out at all. You played it really cool and you dealed with them so well. And I think Banji is the perfect word for you guys because you are so special. Yeah. Thank you. Mm. You've got some stories going on. Now, next week is our 250th show, so we have an unmissable performance as Travis is going to be dancing with our next generation judge, Maddie, on the stage. It's very exciting. Very exciting. Have you got something special lined up for us, Maddie? I do. Can you give me any hints? No. Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> I won't ask in future then. Fine. Plus.